Hello Leo, my name is Agatha and this is your forecast for April 2017. This is a very general reading. If you'd like a private consultation, please write to duniazar.gmail.com and I'd be delighted to work with you. This month is going to be an oracle reading and I'm using the Magdalene oracle and it's going to be beginning, middle and end of the month. The cards that came out for you, Leo, were in the beginning of the month, surrender, in the middle of the month, family, and then at the end of the month, war and peace. So you, if there's any type of conflict within your family in April 2017, there's nothing you can do. You just have to wait it out. You have to surrender and accept whatever conflict happens within your family, connected with your family, connected with you. And you just have to, you know, accept it and wait it out. So I'm going to read a bit more about these cards from the little guidebook. Because I think it's better. So Leo, in the beginning of the month you got surrender. And uh, according to the guidebook, uh, whatever, at least in the beginning of the month of uh, April 2017, Leo, it seems, it seems that whatever you try, uh, the more the things you want elude you. you. You don't seem to get what you want. So you should wait, you should surrender your expectations and you should be patient. And with time you will get what you want. But maybe what you want will not come in the form uh, that you expected or in the form that you wanted. Uh, anyway, also the message connected with, it, with this card is that you cannot control how other people view, view, think of you or say about you. There's nothing you can do, okay? It's, it's about them. Just uh, So also another thing, whatever is happening that is forcing you to wait and be patient. Uh, understand that even if you don't see it, it's a blessing. Things are uh, what's happening, it's what's supposed to happen. And if you don't get what you want, it's, it's, more, um, it's more like a blessing. Okay? Understand it's more like a blessing. Okay? Uh, also, another uh, another message connected with this card is that the emotional ups and downs uh, that you are experience, experiencing will soon stabilize. Stabilize. Ah, they'll be over. Okay, as soon as you accept it, as soon as you become patient. So this is the beginning of the month for April 2017, and I'm thinking that whatever you want, your obstacle is your family, and the obstacles are connected with your family somehow. Maybe there's someone who's being a jerk and doesn't allow you to, to go after what you want, whatever it is. Or there's nothing, they're not doing anything uh, to sabotage you or to prevent you from getting what you want. But there's something, a situation connected with your family that will prevent you from, uh, from going after of what you desire. Okay? So... Something connected with your family. Also, your family might be some some people within your family might be thinking about you in a very. They might be saying bad things about you, or they might be view, view, viewing you in a very negative way. Probably because of the things that you want and desire. There's nothing you can do. Just accept it. It's okay. It's fine. So the card, um, the message connected with the family in the middle of the month. Leo is that uh, you must remember that you were born into a certain family for a reason and for a purpose. And also you shouldn't believe in the myth, the myth that all family members should get along and just be nice to each other. The family is the greatest teacher. Okay. So the family is the perfect environment for you to learn unconditional love because there's someone who has a certain type of trait that you just don't like and vice versa. Okay. But within this environment is where you will learn all the, le the spiritual lessons that you need to learn. And you're learning something. You're learning something this month, Leo. So, uh, and then at the end of the month, the end of the month, you got war and peace. Again, this tells me there's some sort of conflict within family. And there's nothing you can do about it. You might even be the witness. You might might not even be in the middle of this conflict. You just you're just a witness, and there's nothing you can do. You just just have to wait it out. For others, it, it, it could be connected with you. This conflict can be connected with you. But this card in particular, War and Peace, says that there's a clash between your mind and your heart. So 
you want something, your family is in the way, and then your mind is telling you one thing, and your heart is telling you another. So how do you solve this? How do you solve this? So you being you are being pulled in two different direction directions, and this is creating you inner war, inner stress. So you should embrace at the same time. This is the advice connected with this card. You should embrace your heart and your mind. Okay? You should trust your heart, but you should apply logic and common sense. This is not very easy. Okay? You have to embrace. The way to end this war is to embrace both parts, uh, logic and intuition. Okay? Mind and heart. Uh, only by doing what feels right to your heart will help you move closer to fulfilling your dreams. So you have to wait it out. You have to make a plan. The family is in the way. Okay, that's fine. That is fine. Understand that they are your greater spiritual teachers and vice versa. You are spiritual teachers to the ones in your family as well. And maybe you should wait. Follow your heart. But apply logic, build a plan, uh, have a strategy, and use common sense. Whatever, but your family is in the way. And some, somehow, and I don't know how, but it's in the way. Maybe not on purpose, maybe stuff happens, you know, and you have to wait because something is connected with your family that kind of forces you to wait. And that's it. Leo, this is the reading that I have for you for... Um, April 2017, this is a very general reading. If you'd like a private consultation, please send an email to dunyazada.gmail.com and I'd be delighted to work with you.